So, EA dropped the Max 87 base hero upgrade. Let's open these up and see what we get. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast, and reliable ultimate team coins, check out mmoexp.com. Link in the description. Save 5% using code HABER. So, in terms of the best heroes you can get, yeah, yeah, Torre and Ramirez are up there over a mil. Uh, you've got Marquiso, Alawire, and Cordoba. Then you've got Sydney Govu, Keen, Cole, Smolarek, and Kewel. They are some of the best heroes you can get in this. Realistically, we want that Brazil flag or that Ivory Coast flag. They're the two main ones. Here we go with my base hero pack. Come on, EA. Harry Kewel? No. Okay. Cahill, who actually at this stage of the game probably isn't terrible. Um, I think with the power header trait, he actually, if you get someone that can just, you know, bang across into the box. I can't imagine he'd be awful, to be fair. I can't imagine he'd be awful. Um, he could play centre mid as well, which I don't think is a terrible card at centre mid either. I'll have, I'll take that. It's not super expensive, but for for an 86 rated squad, it's in my opinion absolutely worth completing. All right, our next max 87 base hero pack. Come on, EA, big nation, please. Notch, Cam, is that Schneider? No, Schneider's. What rating Schneider? It's Dirk Cow. The thing is, at this stage of the game, I mean, what we're in, it's October 14th today, right? October 15th, right? At this stage of the game, a lot of these cards are going to be usable, just not for super long. Schneider's 88, makes sense. Uh, a lot of these cards are going to be usable, just not for, a, like, a good period of time. Like, this card will probably be a decent centre mid for a, a good, probably, month, and then he might drop off a little bit. All right, next Max 87 base hero card. Come on. English, right? Wait, Joe Cole, right? Joe Cole. Joe Cole, that's a W, man. That is an absolute W. We'll take that. Nice. Is Joe Cole worth a good amount? I'm pretty sure he was on that list, right? I, yeah, 250k. Solid, man. That is a good card, to be fair, as well. Like, that's actually just a decent looking card. You can play Cam or Left Wing as well. Um, and good in-game stats. Joe Cole is our first W of the day. We'll take that. So this SBC is coming in at around 75,000 coins as well. So Joe Cole is about triple the value. You take that. Make sure to leave a like and leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys get in your pack as well, boys. Dimitar. Is that Dimitar Berbatov? I think it might be. Oh, yeah. Big Dimitar Berbatov. Again, I don't know his price, really. I'm going to check. I'm not clued up with the hero prices this year. Um... About 62k. To be fair, Dario is a massive Man United fan, so he is over the moon with that. Just because it's Dimitar. Um, he is over the moon with that, to be fair. But doesn't pay for the pack. But I'd be I'd be buzzing if I got Dimitar as well. We got our next Max 87 base hero pack. Who is gonna be in the pack today? Is that back to back Dimitar? If you're not a United fan, maybe Spurs as well, maybe Leverkusen, you're probably not super over the moon with Dimitar Berbatov, but he is one of the new heroes and I reckon he'd probably do an absolute jar. Oh, he's got an Arsenal kit on. Oh, this probably won't go down very well, will it? That one might not go down very well. But I'm just going to store it in the club and, and pretend it never happened and move on. Max 87 Bash... What? Bassy Shell Spiller. I knew that. I knew that. Here we go. All the way... I, I think that's Aljaber. I think that might be Aljaber. It's Al Jaber, who I've heard, by the way, is very good this year. Now, his value will not align that at all because it's Al Jaber, right? But I've heard that he's actually incredible this year. Sadly, wasn't Alawiran, which is very disappointing. All right, he started off with the 175,000 coin store pack here. I didn't even read the description. I have no idea what could be in this. It's not a trailblazer. It's the Chilean goalkeeper. She is 88. It'd be a double. It is a double walkout as well. This could be exciting. This could be very exciting. Go on, be someone, be Alexia Putellas. Why not? Why not? Who's that? Oh, man. Okay, I'm very glad. Thank goodness that there was not a uh, Trailblazer card in there. Because you know how awful it would have been getting French striker PSG Trailblazer. But it's obviously not the Trailblazer. Now, after the Katoto, it's time for the Kahiro pack. Which is going to be Nakata. Nakoto and Nakata. Nak Nakatoto. No, that doesn't really work. Anyway, that card is definitely usable at this stage of the game. Definitely usable right now. Might not be in time to come, but at this stage of the game, absolutely is. All right. 
next what bro has got really good pack luck all right he has got a fully incredible team that is just absolutely sauce so maybe he's gonna add to that us left beasley i think who i don't think looks that bad gets a lot of stick this card i think it looks all right he's got good pace good dribbling like yes to be fair it could be a gold card that I, and and you know maybe it doesn't look that great actually now that i look at it maybe it's not that amazing but i feel like he'd be okay for like just like you know a solid left mid or a, a, maybe even a left center mid and a narrow to be fair come on EA, next base hero i want to see something spicy english striker is that peter crouch is that a two meter peter okay that's not that spicy is it that's about as spicy as salt right there um yeah no not not ideal unfortunately that is that is that is not very spicy okay next up come on yeah we still not had a ramirez or yeah a Torre yet or a marquisio oh who's that john olorisa that's our first john olorisa as a united fan i don't really like him that much but i feel like if i packed him i think he'd be a great like left center mid or a left dm in a 4-2-3-1 for example and i just want to see how powerful his shots are in game um it's probably not that bad of a card to own to be fair, he might even be like a decent left back. He's he's worth almost double what the pack's actually worth. So it's definitely a W. I mean, we'll take that. Here we go with the next 87 plus maximum hero pack. 87 plus? No. 87 maximum hero pack. I keep saying 87 plus, but it's not an 87 plus. We do get ourselves Alaw... Uh, sorry, Alawiren. What am I talking about, Ryan? Sorry, I'm tired. We get ourselves back to back John Honorises. It looks disgusting him in the, in the United kit. I'm skipping it. I'm sorry. It looks grim, him in the United kit. But it's still a decent card. We'll take it. All right, we go again. We're on to our next hero pack. Who is the nation going to be today? Mexico, goalkeeper. We have our first one that makes me want to throw the controller at the wall. It is Campos. It is a massive L. Zero love for this card at all. Get him off the screen ASAP. All right, Dario's second account has got the hero pack as well. I think it's like an RTG account or just a second account. I'm not sure. Who is going to get in this one? English right mid right mid oh is that mcmanaman it might be it is mcmanaman he actually looks pretty good the only issue with this card i think is his shooting his shooting is quite low but i feel like his card in general is quite all right steve mcmanaman he's 110k so it's a w in terms of value um i don't think i think he looks okay i think he looks all right all right what's his hero pack next it's gonna be Bro, don't do that to me. All right. Keen is solid. Keen's very good still. This is an incredibly usable card for a good period of time as well. I think last year he was usable for a good good chunk of time. Uh, 300k as well. So we'll take that. That is that is our best one so far, man. That is our best one so far. But I, I, I'm not going to lie to you. Like, I just, I'm tired, all right? So I, I saw the Irish flag and my brain went to Yaya Torre straight away. But, obviously, like, you know, it was only for a brief moment. And you lot at home 100% thought it as well. 100%. All right, well, that wasn't the greatest of trolls in the world, to be fair. Uh, that wasn't super fun, unfortunately. We go again. Come on, yo, show his ivory coat this time. Sweden. Striker Broly. Well, the start of the game is pretty good striker to have. He's honestly not a bad card. Uh, gets a good link to Rolfo as well, Swedish link. That's definitely a card that, like, in Div Rivals and, like, Div 5 down to Div 2, he'd probably tear up most defences. His team has been gutted for this chat. His team was gutted. Now, the thing is, he's missing now a goalkeeper left back and striker. He can only get one card in this. There's a striker, big Landon Donovan. Is he good? Let's have a good stats. I mean, right now he's probably pretty good. That's a pretty that's a pretty solid striker card right there, man. That's a pretty solid striker card, I feel, I feel like. Yeah, he's not what everyone wants. He's not the super fancy, like, super amazing card. But he's definitely a card people will want. Right, he's got the Philly Union badge, which only means one thing. We're getting Kai Wagner, even though it's a hero pack. Rolene? No, Freddie Lumberg. Freddy Lumber. I almost said Freddy Fazbear. I need to get off TikTok. Freddy Lumberg, even at this stage of the game, like it's it's alright. It's just not super exciting, is it? We've got another Bassi Bassi Spelter. Bassi Sheltspiller. There you go. And then we've got another Dimitar Berbatov. 
I wish I'd have got him, man. I wish they got him on my account. I love Dimitar so much. The last hero pack of the video. 20 hero packs opened. Let's see if we can end off with something good, EA. Please, let's end it off with an absolute bang. Come on. Let's end it off with Ramirez Ayaya Torre. Come on. English? Right mid is another Steve McManaman. If you guys have enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new around here. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you lads later.